more wise guy horror from the Empire State for Halloween Marathon 2020, with Bachelor Party in the Bungalow of the Damned from 2008, written and directed by Brian Thompson. A Lloyd Kaufman cameo usually blesses a low-budget exploitation feature, and Bachelor Party in the Bungalow of the Damned is no exception. The film encapsulates perfectly the perspiring awkwardness of a low-rent stag night, and that sad atmosphere becomes a great launching pad for succubus carnage. Despite most of the characters being toxic arseholes, they are at least well-written arseholes with layers to their personalities and have convincing relationship dynamics between each other. Also acted with a surprising amount of charisma by the cast. I could not single out a bad performance amongst them. They are a solid troupe that makes the brisk 78 minute running time even more so. Also, unlike most low budget horror films of its time, Bachelor Party does not leave it to post and produces consistently well lit and well composed shots, though most are ruined by ugly looking filters blown out windows, as well as some shoddy looking day for night. Yes, there is also a CGI in this, and it is as cheap as you think it looks, but it is used sparingly, and displays quite a lot of creativity for what must have been a non-existent FX budget. Never does the story delve into annoying tangents or ever loses pace, which for me is the most remarkable element, as I see so many films like it become indulgent with their side characters and their little side quests, it's such an easy way to pad out a film and you make your cast happy in the process by giving them more screen time. Bachelor Party does not have ambition, but it does have values in both entertaining its audience as well as maximising its bare resources to the max. It's simply a well-made late 2000s sex horror comedy that whilst not laugh out loud or even actually remotely funny, is indeed knowingly crass and feels very traumatastic in its tone which is a plus in my book. There are just some independent general productions out there where a decent cast and competent technicians join forces to create something that is satisfyingly adequate. Bachelor Party in the Bungalow of the Damned is short, cheap, but is well directed and acted, and I would have no problem recommending this to any fan of trauma-like films. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe. Tomorrow's film is Nine Lives.